Amy at EarlLooksHome.com and I would like to tell you about this exquisite, huge Louis XV antique buffet. It's our item number 22-360 and boy is this a beauty. It is one of the tallest pieces that we have in the gallery right now. It actually measures 109.5 inches high, so you really need tall ceilings for this one. It's 62.75 wide and then 22 and a half deep. So a nice big one gives you lots of storage space as well as lots of display space. So a really practical piece um, as well as super beautiful. So, boy, where to start? It dates right about 1890, and it is completely hand-carved in mahogany. Uh, it does have just a really beautiful, warm, reddish tone in person. Uh, the top is a little bit redder. The bottom, while it, it's not a drastic difference, it is a little lighter. There probably was a little more sunlight that came on this. So it's a little more golden on the bottom, a little more reddish up on the top, but it blends very well and it looks just beautiful in person. So let's start all the way up at the top. Look at those gorgeous carvings, all completely hand carved in solid mahogany. You have the big Louis the 15th C curve up at the top and then surrounded by hand carved roses that are just cascading down that big curved top. Really pretty. Then as you come down, you see some carved flourishes there on around the top of the door. And that is the original beveled glass. You can see that the beveling follows the carvings. Uh, you do have these two little side windows, which just add a little bit more character to the piece. You have these pretty little carved um, panels in there. It's all one piece of glass, but you have these little um, carvings that make it look like separate panels. Then over there at the edge of the piece, you see more cascading flowers. Again, really deeply carved into the side of the piece. And you do see all this pretty mahogany veining in the wood. Even the, instead of escutcheons, we have carved um, little C curves there, part of the Louis the 15th style, the Rococo style. Um, more carvings here along the bottom of the door. And I'll go ahead and open the door for you. I'm kind of short, so make sure I can do it. Okay. So these great big doors, when you open them up, you have all kind of display space. And the, it is lined in a red fabric that is faded here along the edges from the light, but it doesn't look bad. It's, it's really um, gives it that antique worn um, feel to it. So let me just lock that back. There we go. Coming farther down, you have again a shell motif here, more little flowers, this nice curves here along the side, all kinds of carvings, beautiful mahogany graining there along the back and on the, the top of the buffet bottom. As you continue to come down, you have, look at this beautiful hardware, Louis the original Louis the 15th hardware. And I'll pull the drawer open so you see. It is lined in shelf paper. You could remove that, but it's a rather tasteful design, rather pretty. So as you keep coming down, you have all these lots of carvings here and then nice curves on the door, more carvings coming all the way down to the bottom is a shell motif there at the bottom. And then I'll go ahead and open this door for you. Shows that you have lots of storage space there on the inside. So really just a very nice practical piece. Oh, I'll even point out we have cabriole legs, nice curvy foot, lots of pretty carvings. So just a gorgeous Louis the 15th style piece. Um, Louis the 15th is just known for all of those swirls and, and flourishes and lots of carving. And this piece has it in spades. This is just a really stunning piece in person. If you're looking for a big eye catcher to put maybe in your main living room or, or it could even go in a bedroom, uh, wherever you would like, just a really breathtaking piece. Maybe this is the one for you. So please feel free to give me a call if I can answer any additional questions for you at 803-276-4001. 
Remember that Eurolux Home includes free shipping within the continental U.S. and some places in Canada. But let me know what you would put here in these beautiful big glass windows in the comments below.